A large section of the internet is apparently very happy that Taylor Swift is holding a grudge against Kim Kardashian. Taylor Swift has come for Kim Kardashian. Hair of the sex tape fame and credit card fraud allegedly has now been dragged through the mud by Taylor and the internet. Check this out. I was not expecting for 2024 on my bingo card for Taylor Swift to write a diss song to Kim Kardashian. Taylor Swift just released her album and there is a song about Kim Kardashian. Kim Kardashian probably thought she was- Kim Kardashian has reacted to Taylor Swift's diss track about her. Taylor recently released a brand new diss track about Kim Kardashian and the song is titled, Thank You Amy. Because the- And maybe you've reframed- So it's come to my attention that some people are a little confused by the Taylor Swift diss track. Taylor Swift just released a Kim Kardashian diss track. Tell me I'm wrong. Hello? Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, no, I can barely hear you. Oh, can you hear me now? Yeah, I can hear you now. How are you, Judy? I'm good. I just, I just have anxiety. Are you sure it's safe here? Hello? Okay. No. Hmm. Am you and Taylor Swift? I don't think you've changed. All that time you were throwing punches at this is the tea I've been waiting my whole life for. Taylor. Like, I can't even be overwhelmed and have a bad day because... A large section of the internet is apparently very happy that Taylor Swift is holding a grudge against Kim Kardashian. This conversation is obviously happening in the wake of Taylor being named Time's Person of the Year because in the interview, Taylor addressed the infamous Kanye Kim phone call situation. And I know you little girls ain't laughing at me. I don't think you've changed much. Do you remember when Kim Kardashian was asked about her feud with Taylor Swift? And this is what she said. Let's have a look. Kim, you and Taylor Swift, still a beef with Taylor after all that went down? No, squash. Over it. Over it. Good. I'm with Aaliyah, with Aaliyah, he doesn't see her. There's no way Taylor forgives her or is yeah. over it. And I think this was pretty clear that she's pretty not. Clear. And everyone... She needed cold, hard proof, so I gave her some. Taylor Swift just came for Kim Kardashian in her new song, Thank You, Amy. In case you don't know, Taylor came out with not one, but two albums tonight. And one of her new 31 songs is called Thank You, Amy. If you notice, the K, I, and M are capitalized, spelling out Kim. Not so subtle. The Taylor Swift ha escrito el nombre de Kim Kardashian en uno de los títulos de sus canciones de su nuevo álbum. Entremos inmediatamente en este chismecito. Oh, look like Trish woke up. Hey. I don't think you've I changed it. much. It's amazing. Kim Kardashian and Northwest were dancing to a Taylor Swift song, specifically Shake It Off, in their latest TikTok. I feel like I've been waiting for this to happen. I always wondered what the conversation there was, like if Kim's kids wanted to listen to Taylor Swift, like was that allowed? But we already- Taylor. I don't think you've changed much. For those of y'all- Seven years ago today- I don't think you've Taylor Swift album came out <clears throat> and everybody talking about her and Kim, but there's more pressing matters going on with this album. Taylor Swift sat her Swiffer wet jet basic bob ass up on It's come to my attention that some people don't actually know what went down between these two, so we're gonna I just woke up. Mommy, let's play the new Taylor. Shut the fuck up. New album. Number one song on my iPod, Taylor Swift Love Story. I <laughs> you listening to the new album? Yep. And I got on the phone with Kim and I told her, you better tell your lame excuse of a husband that I made that bitch fucking famous. But wait. There is so much more because the internet is not done yet and they are coming for Kim full force. Check this out. Don't pick up, don't pick up. Hey, Kimmy! Our numero uno client. Our skimmy legend. Oh, I like that. Yeah, skinny, skinny legend, legend but skims. <laughs> so we have some good news. And some bad news. But some really good news. What? Taylor Swift has publicly thanked you. Yeah, she said that she actually couldn't have built her empire without you. Yeah, and uh, that you basically made Taylor, made Taylor Swift. Swift. Really? You did that. <laughs> What's the bad news? Well, Hello. Uh, she also poetically slanders you by calling you a high school bully, saying that North dances to songs about hating you, and also that the holy woman Mama Swift just wishes of your unalivement. <laughs> Number one song on my iPod, Taylor Swift Love. I don't think you've 
changed much. I love the Swifties. I love the fact that a ton of people in Taylor Swift's inner circle have done Taylor Swift is calling out Kim Kardashian on her new album, The Tortured Poets Department. You didn't know Kim Kardashian and Taylor Swift have been feuding for the last seven years. Dear Kanye West allegedly got permission from Taylor Swift to call her a bitch in one of his songs. Taylor Swift denied ever giving Kanye permission to call her a bitch, and Kim Kardashian released a secret edited video of the conversation that suggested otherwise. Since then, an unedited version of the video has come out showing that Taylor Swift never actually lied and Kim K is the one that did. So fast forward to tonight where Taylor Swift released a song, Thank You Amy, with a capital K-I-M. Also kind of reminds me- I don't think you've changed much. He said that if the sex was half as good as the conversation was, soon they'd be pushing stroke. Kim Kardashian going to respond to Taylor Swift's Time Magazine interview. As you can see, the Swifties are going hard at Kim. Does she deserve it? Is this well deserved or is this just an overblown personal drama? What do you think? Personally, I think it's well deserved and I say go Tay Tay. You know, I'm doing much better now, but I still have all of these feelings and it would really be nice to get them out. Okay, well, well, bitch, you already know what I'm about to say, right? Are you saying I should talk about her in the album? Beautiful, talented, and smart. Bitch, if you had a fat ass, you'd be unstoppable. Shit, you'd be able to whoop Thanos' ass over here worried about Kim Kardashian. I don't know, Cat Williams. I mean, she has so many fans. Lord, help me to communicate effectively with this white woman. Taylor, you one of the most successful entertainers in the world. She ain't even the most famous Kardashian. OJ is. O.J. Simpson? Bitch, he sliced them two people up like it was nothing, and then he got away with it. He is the most famous Kardashian. Ain't nobody else that famous. Fuck out of here. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna mention all that in the song. You damn right, because then you would have to credit me. I ain't working for free, bitch. If I mention her by name, I could get sued. Bitch, you be out here leaving some footprints and clues and riddles like you the motherfucking Riddler and all your fans is Batman, bitch. Just do some of that shit. Be all I don't think you've changed much.